All right, you scoopers. Here we have another rendition. Wait, no, get back up. Of Red Dead Redemption. So I just picked up a uh, Gatling gun from and shot up a bunch of miners at a mine camp inside a mine and I uh, rolled along on another mine cart just like in Donkey Kong Country seems to be a lot of those mine carts in video games these days huh now I'm gonna go and see what Wes the charlatan who sells a bunch of fake miracle tonics I'm gonna see what he's up to what kind of ruses he's got going on and if I need to you know Shoot him. So being a jerk. But we'll see. We'll see. Maybe he has a role to play in my revenge on Bill Williamson. But every now and then. Oh, you can go hunting. A hunting we will go. Oh. It was a horse? Oops. I didn't mean to kill the wild horse. I guess meat is meat. Stop trying to eat my horse. Can't you see how gaunt he is? Hey! I wanted to skin the coyote. So I can make more money because I'm so greedy. But I got like 700 bucks now. I'm worthy of this fancy suit. Probably could have a better horse though. But I like Benedict. A wolf heart? Can you cook that? He cuts the skin off with such ease. There was another coyote, but... You know, I got places to be. Stop it! I'm in a full moon out tonight. Best not be wandering around these parts by yourself. You could get shot up. But wouldn't it be nice on a night like this to just ride around in the Old West? Where is this freak? Ah, 5 a.m. and 10 p.m.? What time is it now? It's like 1. I'll just have to camp out under the stars tonight. Shut up. Mr. Marston, don't be so childish. Come on, sir, I implore you. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So I made a few innocent mistakes when last we met. But my plan is still sound. Together we can conquer, if not the world, and certainly Bill Williamson. But first, you need me to do you a favor? <laughs> you read my mind. I can only deduce it. You've been taking my tonic, sir, as instructed. It can give the most ordinary of intelligences a remarkable insight. I'll give you insight. I'll show you what your guts look like. Please, sir, the show... How clever. It's nothing short of embarrassing. Think for a moment, sir. Think. I'm thinking about how much of my time you're wasting. If you give me that top hat, we'll call it even. Um, allow me to act selfishly and sell some of my wares. No. Quit being a stooge. Mingle with the crowd until the show starts. Friends, no. Hardworking souls of plain view. Do you suffer from rheumatism, lumbago, acute chronic sciatic, neurologic, or inflammatory pain? Well, yes. I represent the only company that makes the genuine article which cures headache, neuralgia, uh, toothache, earache, backache, oh. This man is a fucking charlatan. He just got done swindling us down at Cho Springs with this song and dance. I say we tar and feather him right now. I say we shoot the uh, bastard. I think it's time to take a business elsewhere. Uh, I apologize if science is not your forte. Good day, one and all. Well, that went badly. This is wonderful. Riding on the passenger seat on a wagon is also known as riding shotgun. Thank you for telling me this during this shootout. Okay. Get out of the way, freak. Your hat! Where did your hat go? I want it. This is kind of fun. Look at them. Stra straggling behind. I'm getting... The shotgun out. 
Hey! Looks like you're gonna have to have some of your own tonic, eh, Wes? Keep going! What are you doing? Why are you stopping? Keep going. I need something with a higher rate of fire. Oh my gosh, there's so many! All these horses! Great. I can't even tell who ha who's a who's on the horse. Good grief. Keep going. Hurry. Why are you riding so slow? You can shoot crates of TNT. Thank you. Uh-oh, there are people in the front. I'm going to go back to my revolver. I killed the horse. I know, I know. There we go. Another one. I got plenty more bullets where that came from, fellas. Oh, baby. Beauty. Wait, I want to shoot this bird. <laughs> Maybe it was me that hit you, but, you know, you are in the driver's side. And they were on the driver's side. Well, you survived a lot of bullet shots. Maybe your tonic does work. To some degree. I know. I'm great. It always impresses me with the speed with which a group of men can turn from passive sheep into murderous wolves. I'm impressed with how you nearly got us killed back there. That's right. Yeah, so perhaps we should shelve the tonics business for a period. Let's say we try our hand at racing again. If there's a meet at Ratskeller. You're trying my patience, Mr. West Dickens. That's right, I don't want to race again. I'm sorry, dear boy, but I'm only an aging vendor of exotic elixirs, not the bloody U.S. cavalry. Forgive me if matters take some time to prepare. I won't forgive you. Now I take all my frustrations out on these coyotes. I'm gonna skin these wolves dead. Come here, Benedict. Here, boy. There you are. I hear some shooting. Oh, he's hunting. I ain't a gambling man. Unless it's your life. Hello, funny man? Are you here? My controller batteries are low. Well... He's not, but a container, that's all. How dare you? There's a snake. Time to skin the snake, baby. Uh, looks, looks delicious. My horse is down there. That hurt. I probably broke my ankles, but I'm still running. First, I want to... Hello, sir. Hey, you didn't say hello back. Maybe I ought to lasso you. Give me this bandana. Somebody shooting somebody up here? My friend? Who is this? Alright, now I'm gonna be a real hero. A vigilante of justice. Alright. He's not gonna get far. Time to use my brute force. My horse is trying to save me. Oh no, my horse! I can't believe you! Now you're both hogtied. My horse! He's dead, Benedict, no! Be a Christian and let me go, please! Alright, fine. <laughs> I did not want to hug you. You killed my horse. Can't believe you were trying to kidnap. Now, you'll know what it's like to be carried around like a buffoon. You killed my horse. No, I think I should drop you off the pier. Actually, it'll be even more detrimental for you. My controller died. Well, friends... This is it. 
the end of us all. Hold on for one moment. Finally found some working batteries. So now I can complete my work. Howdy. Just gonna drown a criminal and try not to drown myself in the process. Careful. Look at this deep, deep water. And you all tied up not being able to swim. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my gosh. I am gonna kill myself if I do that. Holy crap. That was close. No, I can't. I'll just have to drop him in shallow wire. Water. Nobody help this guy. He's a criminal. He tried to kidnap somebody. Dang it! We both died. And it was at that very moment that John Marston died, trying to protect the one thing that he loved most. His horse, Benedict. And though his journey has ended, his memory still lives on in the Wild West. <laughs> Just kidding, guys. You want to say that to my face, buddy? He didn't even know. <laughs> oh, there's my real horse. Oops. All right, friends. I'm all tuckered out, said John Marsden. It's time for me to hit the hay. Thanks for watching, you crazy guys. Overwrite. Goodbye.